Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. And this is the second year's um, uh, 11th February newspaper, Turns Based Dawn. Um, Prime Minister asks the BDM leaders why they did not stop whole trade and says he received offers from many sides to sell votes during the previous Senate elections. By Sayed Irfan Chaza, Islamabad Prime Minister Imran Khan on Wednesday asked the leaders of the Pakistan Democratic Movement, the BDM, the anti-government alliance of Ten opposition parties, why they did not close the doors of corruption in a Senate elections during their 30 year rule. These thieves who call themselves politicians and have made a union to end the BDM to protect their corruption should be questioned that they remained in power for 30 years, but why did they not uh, try to stop it? Force trading in Senate polls, the Prime Minister said, while uh, talking to media after attending launching ceremony of the second phase of the ASAS Kapalath program in Kalar Saita Tassil in Rawalpindi. Mr. Khan said, and the trend of uh, purchasing votes in a Senate election during the last 30 years has, uh, was a big question marked on the credibility of politicians who supported a corrupt, corrupt system. While the political leadership of the opposition knows that money is traded for Senate elections, why didn't they make an effort to exchange it? The system question to the Prime Minister. Uh, because they themselves make money from it, he added. In a response to a query on the video league is showing the politicians buying and selling votes before the 2018 Senate elections, he Colored Saida, Prime Minister Imran Khan, talking to the beneficiaries of ASAS Kapalath program on Wednesday on PPI. And said a big question lies ahead whether to go for Senate polls with the old corrupt system or to act in a transparent way instead. Prime Minister Khan said these corrupt practices became evident unto him after he and his party members received offers from multiple sides to sell votes during the previous Senate elections. He recalled that he was approached by different people and offered funds for Shaka Khan Hospital, which was another mood of bribe. One kind of democracy in this um, where votes are sold, and this is nothing but a blot on the democracy. He said, adding that he had to move. 20 MPs from his party who took money for votes in the last Senate elections, after which some of them approached the court against the action. Responding to the opposition's allegations that, the, that he already knew about the video claim, Mr. Khan said, had he known about it, he would have presented it before the court. The PTD, the PDM has made an alliance to protect their corruption and ill-gotten money, he said. The market of corruption in politics is on the rise, um, but no other party is willing to change it, he said, regretting that in the past people became Senators by buying votes from members of the National and Provincial Assemblies. Prime Minister Khan said that currently 
the rate for a single salad throat in Balochistan ranged between rupees 500 million and rupees 700 million, which was unfortunate. Those involved in such extravagance will later recover the money they spend by minting money from the public exchequer, he added. Replying to a question about Jamiyat of My Islam Fazl, Chief Amolana Fazl Rahman's advice to him to learn politics from him, Imran Khan said the JUIF chief himself was the one who benefited the most from the secret ballot. I have been advocating for an open ballot for the last five years, he added. The Prime Minister recalled that the Pakistan Muslim League Namaz and the Pakistan People's Party had earlier signed a charter of democracy and agreed on open ballot for the Senate elections, but had now changed their minds to uh, cover their corruption. The ruling party can take more benefit from secret ballot because of being in the government. But even then, we want to change the system for the benefit of the country and to end corruption, he added. The Prime Minister said that with corruption at the leadership level, honesty at lower tires uh, could not be expected. Talking about inflation, he said, devaluation of Pakistani currency against dollar had resulted in price high. He said that during the PPP government, the rupee got weakened by about 25%, while in Pakistan, the Insaf government, rupees value declined by 22.5% against dollar. And in the end, the formal request, if you have not yet, please subscribe our channel and press the like and bell button to get the press from us. Thank you for watching. Have a nice time. Goodbye.